the top of the list from San Beda University is a player to watch out for actually Stilara Andres. The last time we saw her in action in season 95, she was standing with two medals and a championship trophy with her. So we're very excited to see her in action once again. All right, so let's Sorry, begin I... with the performance Kyung of Re. Mara. Junbi. Si Chuck. Chuck. Baru Chariot Kyungre Chariot Kyungre Junbi Si Jack Baru Terlihat Kyungre Serpen, what a performance from Lara Andres, our first performer from the women's division here in day number two of NCAA season 96. Yes, definitely. No? And uh, of course, besides the nice background, yung mga puno, maganda rin ang kanyang performance, especially yung kanyang transition from the different combinations or yung pinatawag natin kung so abangan natin ang score Well, I did say she was a player to watch out for dito sa ating tournament and her final score very impressive 6.86 So that is the tally for Lara Andres from San Beda University so we're very excited and I'm sure, Sir Pen, you're very excited as well to see the performance here from Diana Nicole Supangan from the College of St. Benil.
So, Coach Stephen, what do you think about Diane's performance? Uh, well, si Diane is actually a veteran of many competitions in our association. And very evident then dito yung kanyang mga high kicks, yung front kick, yung side kick. At the same time, yung sharpness of the blocks and punches. Wow, and it looks like she's got the highest score so far with a final score. Yes, she does have the highest score so far, 7.28. So, siya po, nanguna ngayon sa ating women's division, surpassing Lara Andres' score earlier from San Beda University. But coming up next, she's somewhat of a prodigy from Jose Rizal University. I'm sure Sir Paul Supan is excited and delighted to see this 16-year-old in action, Emmy Soriano Fernandez. Let's watch her performance. Kyungbe. Jimbi. Shichok. Coach Stephen, I remember when we were talking about covering this Taekwondo event, you were telling me about how this is going to be the first time that JRU is participating in Standard Pumse Day for women's. Is that right? Yes, that's uh, that's true. It's the first time JR, wow. JRU has participated. And based on the performance of Emmy Fernandez, it's a very solid performance. Very good uh, show in both uh, executions of both Pumse. Wow, look at those numbers. And... We have a new leader, Emmy Soriano Fernandez, 16 years old. Wow, rising to the top of our standing so far. She's got the highest score, surpassing the previous total of Diana Nicole Supangan from the College of St. Benil. So we're down to our last.